Hey everyone, it's Lens Addict here, and today I'm going to show you what happens when you run your Tesla out of battery and what it does as it slowly runs out of battery. So I've got a Tesla Model 3 here that's showing 0%, but it still keeps driving. So how far can we keep driving? And I guess what happens as it progressively gets below that 0% and slowly starts, slowly starts shutting down. So let's see. So as we can see, this car is at 0%, um, zero, zero. Uh, we're running it empty slowly by um, running the AC. And you can see there's a little, like it has a limit on how fast it'll accelerate. Uh, but it's still pretty quick. Like if I go drive, um, I would say that this car has still got some juice in it. So like, you watch the accelerator the speedo. It's still pretty quick. Certainly not slow. Oh. But yeah, it's still going. And I guess that barber pole or that little uh, reduced acceleration will just get more and more reduced as the car has less and less battery to, to give out. But I, I'm just curious, like, it's still pretty quick. But it's definitely not as quick as it is when it's got a full charge. So let's keep running it flat and see what happens. And I think it has a little buffer and you can actually see this buffer. So I'll show you. So I believe you can see the buffer. And if you go into service mode and you go high voltage, high voltage system. So it does show 0% here, but then under power distribution, we get a 4.2%. So I think that is the buffer and the car still has 4% left. Um, so if we, yeah, if we keep running the um, air conditioning, I believe we're going to see that pole slowly dip down as we run the car out of battery. So I think we're getting near the end of the battery. It's almost completely limited the power and we're gonna try service mode again. Let's see what battery it's got left. So yeah, it looks like it's got 2% left. Um, so yeah, it's slowly getting lower and lower. Um, but yeah, let's see how much acceleration it's got left at uh, 2%. So far, no error messages other than like your usual sentry mode unavailable and charge now and all that stuff. So if we park the car and we walk out, I'm actually curious what we're gonna get if we get any like error messages. So the car is parked. Uh, let's see what it shows on the screen because it's so low now. It must be really trying to tell us that that's not normal to have it so low. So let's have a look at what we see. No error messages, nothing. It's just sentry mode unavailable. That's, that's it. Still happy to drive. How, how much drive we got? Oh man, it's getting low, but still happy to drive. Hasn't got much left in it now. Like it barely accelerates. Actually, I think it's about to shut down. It barely wants to move. Like um, if you actually floor it, it's real slow now. So like I'll floor it. Oh, it doesn't move at all. That's foot to the floor. Look at that. It's like barely moving at this point. So yeah, battery's pretty much about to give in. We'll floor it one more time. Oh, that's it. I think this is it. I'm gonna reverse it. I think it's about to stop driving. So we're now getting vehicle shutting down, pull over safely. Um, Let's see if it'll keep driving. Oh, no, nah, that's it. Put the parking brake on. Uh, that's it, it won't move. No more moving. So that's it, we shut it off. We, we got the car to... I think this is what happens. I think this is the car turning off. Let's have a look in service mode. Oh, electrical system is unable to support all features. Let's have a look at service mode. What does service mode say? 
And did we get any... Oh, we got some service alerts. Vehicle load shed H. The low voltage batteries discharging. HVAC system's not normal. Wow, everything's turning off. If only you could turn that sound off, it's so annoying. Oh, God. Um, what about back in service, though? What do we have under the uh, power distribution? Oh, so it's still got 2.3% remaining. So it's got a little bit left. But no, you can't drive the car anymore. That's it. So now the car's charging back up. And... Yeah, it looks like the high voltage battery is slowly charging. And so is the low voltage battery. Um, but yeah, that was really interesting. Um, so basically when, that, when the Tesla got to a low state of charge, it started behaving very strangely. So it had like no power when you floored it, it was like the accelerator pedal was like the first quarter did something and then the rest of the way did nothing. It was very strange. I never experienced it before. And also the power delivery was really like juddery as if it was like an engine that was stalling. Um, really interesting to experience. And then eventually it just started throwing the take, you know, take, um, stop, pull over now, stop immediately, flashing red lights everywhere, the beep, beep, beep noise. And it pretty much just put the car in park on its own and refused to go out of park. And that was it. It, ran, it stopped working. So yeah, it drove about 20 Ks after the low voltage thing, but it probably wasn't helped by me flooring it, uh, even though it barely moved. And it probably also wasn't helped by me running the heater to intentionally run it empty. But yeah, pretty cool to actually see what a Tesla does. So it's got a bit of a buffer, uh, and I'll show you the buffer. So I think we found the buffer. So it's stating one kilometer of range, and the battery's at 5.5%. So it must be a 5.5% buffer uh, that the car has. So that's pretty cool to see um, what the buffer actually is. And you can yeah, kind of confirm it. Just saw one kilometer of range pop up. So yeah, that's what the buffer is. I hope you all enjoyed seeing the Tesla finally run out of charge. Um, if you have any questions about Teslas or anything you want me to try, let me know. I'm really happy to test it. I love trying out all the features of my car and yeah, feel free to ask in the comments. I can answer or I can even make a video on a question you might have. Although I can't do everything, but I, I'll give it my best shot. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more content like this and I hope you all have a great day. Lens Addict out.